Everyone, welcome back to our channel. I'm wishing everyone a day full of Christ's grace. In order to keep up with the most recent information, we hope you enjoy this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Take a trip with us and watch this film through to the conclusion. The Virgin Mary gives her cherished children a profound and urgent message during these turbulent times, stressing the vital significance of spiritual preparation for the difficulties that lie ahead. Her supernatural warning serves as a reminder of the continuing strength of prayer, faith, and divine protection, in addition to being a call to action. The Virgin Mary exhorts us to deepen our faith in God and accept the spiritual solutions offered in order to get through the next hardships as the world experiences more and more trying times. Delivered on a calm evening in a small Mexican church, the message took place in a setting infused with a sense of heavenly presence bathed in a gentle, angelic light that permeated the cathedral with a sense of tranquility and profound mystery, the Virgin Mary appeared to a gathering of pious people. Even though her appearance was breathtaking, it came with a sobering message. Mexico and the rest of the world were about to undergo terrible difficulties. These included the development of diseases, social turmoil, and economic problems. But the Virgin Mary promised that these difficulties were purifications that were required to fortify the people's faith, not punishments. The message of the Virgin Mary emphasizes how crucial faith is to facing the challenges that lie ahead. She emphasizes the importance of applying spiritual treatments and maintaining a firm faith in God, particularly in times of illness and social unrest. The faithful are reminded that despite their seeming difficulty, these tribulations present chances for spiritual development and cleansing. In order to get through the upcoming difficult times, the Virgin Mary exhorts her children to hold fast to their faith, pray diligently, and rely on divine protection. A moving reminder of the effectiveness of divine involvement in our lives is provided by the appearance of the Virgin Mary in the tiny Mexican church. Her appearance was accompanied by a celestial light that represented certainty and hope a lighthouse that led the faithful through the approaching storm. Her message was unambiguous. One should confront the problems ahead with courage and faith, not fear. The purpose of these trials is to prepare the faithful for a deeper spiritual awakening by testing and purifying their spirits. The emphasis on sacred rituals and artifacts as vital protective tools lies at the heart of the Virgin Mary's message. She emphasizes the importance of wearing the Saint Benedict amulet and saying certain prayers as effective ways to protect oneself from evil spirits. Given their spiritual power to fend off evil and safeguard the soul, the faithful are exhorted to adopt these acts with sincerity and dedication. Additionally, the language highlights the imminent danger of diabetes, a fatal and silent illness. The Virgin Mary calls for quick action to protect health and warns of its destructive effects. This caution serves as a reminder that physical attention must be combined with spiritual readiness. Since the body is a temple that needs to be treated with the same utmost care as the soul, the faithful are urged to take proactive measures to safeguard their health. Utilizing holy items, like the Saint Benedict talisman, is a concrete manifestation of faith rather than just a symbolic one. When used with respect and faith, these items act as barriers against potential physical and spiritual threats. The message of the Virgin Mary is an exhortation to incorporate these holy rituals into everyday life in order to strengthen the faithful, both physically and spiritually, against the difficulties that lie ahead. The message of the Virgin Mary is a call to action as well as a warning. She exhorts the faithful to get ready for the approaching darkness on both a spiritual and bodily level. The passage emphasizes how crucial faith and confidence in divine direction are to surviving these hardships. The Virgin Mary exhorts her children to be watchful, to discern the signs of the times, and to move quickly to get ready for the difficulties that lie ahead. The lesson highlights that being spiritually prepared is an active commitment to leading a life based on faith rather than a passive one. To strengthen their relationship with God, the faithful are urged to employ spiritual tools immerse themselves in the scriptures, and pray every day. This preparedness is beneficial not only to the individual, but also to the community as a whole. In order to reach as many souls as possible with the light of truth and hope, the Virgin Mary exhorts the faithful to disseminate this message widely. 
The Virgin Mary also provides comfort by warning the faithful to get ready for the approaching darkness. Reminding her kids that they are never alone, she pledges to be there for them always and to provide them with guidance. For those who stay committed, the light of heavenly protection will shine even in the darkest of times. The message of the Virgin Mary is proof of the enduring strength of faith and the significance of maintaining a relationship with God, particularly in the face of terrible adversity. The call to follow Jesus Christ's teachings and to study the Bible and pray every day is at the core of the Virgin Mary's message. These activities are effective means of strengthening one's spirituality rather than being merely ceremonial. The Virgin Mary highlights that the best way to communicate with God is via prayer, which is how the faithful can ask for strength, protection, and direction. The book exhorts believers to incorporate scripture study and prayer into their daily routines. By keeping people rooted in their religion and offering them guidance and clarity in the midst of the world's volatility and confusion, these activities work as a spiritual anchor. The message of the Virgin Mary emphasizes the transformational potential of these activities and exhorts the faithful to have a close, intimate connection with God by regular prayer and scripture study. The message of the Virgin Mary serves as a reminder that faith is dynamic rather than stagnant. It needs to be continuously nourished by prayer and study of God's word. The faithful can fortify their spiritual determination and maintain their resolution in the midst of hardship by adopting these actions. The Virgin Mary's exhortation to pray and read the Bible is a call to become closer to God, to look for His presence in all facets of life, and to have faith in His divine plan, even when the future seems uncertain. A sincere prayer at the end of the poem expresses the Virgin Mary's profound worry for her children and her wish to help them navigate the difficulties that lie ahead. The prayer is a reaffirmation of confidence in God's boundless love and mercy, as well as a request for heavenly protection. It is an exhortation to the faithful to seek solace in the holy heart of Jesus Christ and to put their faith in the intercession of the Virgin Mary. The faithful are reminded that they are not alone in their difficulties in this parting prayer. For everyone who turns to her, the Virgin Mary's boundless compassion serves as a source of courage and hope. The prayer sums up the essential points of the Virgin Mary's teaching, which are to accept faith, pray constantly, and have faith in God's direction in the face of extraordinary adversity. The prayer also acts as a reminder of the effectiveness of group prayer. For the protection and salvation of all souls, the Virgin Mary exhorts the faithful to join together in prayer, raise their voices in unison, and ask God to step in. The power of prayer becomes a lifeline in these uncertain times, binding the faithful to the divine and to each other in a common mission of hope and spiritual resiliency. The message of the Virgin Mary is a powerful and pressing call to action, asking the faithful to get ready for the hardships that lie ahead both physically and spiritually. It serves as a reminder that the keys to surviving the trials the world will encounter are faith, prayer, and heavenly protection. Assuring her children of her ongoing presence and guidance, the Virgin Mary's words serve as a light of hope, guiding them through the approaching darkness. The faithful are urged to follow Jesus Christ's teachings, read the Bible and pray every day and use the spiritual resources the Virgin Mary has given them to deepen their relationship with God as the world prepares for the tribulations that lie ahead. For those who hold fast to their faith, this message is both a warning and a promise of supernatural protection. The message of the Virgin Mary gives the faithful strength and consolation in these uncertain times by reminding them that they are never alone. With faith as their compass, they can bravely and optimistically confront the difficulties that lie ahead knowing that they are protected by God and the Virgin Mary. I appreciate you joining me on this adventure. This investigation is significant and powerful because of your participation and presence. May the shared tales of our human experience inspire and uplift you until the next time.